Thank you so much for taking the time to stop by Access Hollywood as a Fitbit ambassador. <laughs> so let's just get some Fitbit stuff sure, off the bat right let's away. Do it. How close are you to hitting your step quota for the day? Is 10,000 <laughs> even a drop in the bucket for you? Already? So what is it, like 10 o'clock this morning? Yeah. I, I've got a ways to go to hit that 10,000 mark. But uh, we're running around a, a bunch today, so I'm pretty confident. Yeah, you'll, hit, you'll get there oh, in yeah, no time. <laughs> 100%. You're known as a fitness icon. You're in amazing uh, shape. Thank you. Being a professional dancer mm -hmm. obviously gives you a bit of an edge in that regard. But yeah. as a fit Fit ambassador yeah. and being here to talk about that. I mean, how do you implement your workout secrets in a way that everyday women can follow? No, I mean, I think it's sort of just like figuring out what's important to you. And I think for me, what really switched was I think I, you know, I danced and I ate whatever I wanted and everything, but then I hit like 21, 22, and I was like, I stopped dancing for a little while and my body was changing and all this stuff. So I had to like really figure it out. So then I started working out because I was like, I want my body to be back to how it was. And it was a vanity thing at first, you know, trying to be like, oh, this isn't who I am. And then I realized, like, the minute I switched and I realized that it's actually more than that. Like, I feel so much better about who I am, the decisions that I make, because I'm clear-headed. And everybody always asks me, like, how are you so positive? And I'm like, honestly, it's because I'm physical. Like, I get up and I, like... I, I, not force, but I force myself to, to do it because I know I'm not gonna regret it afterwards and I feel so much better. Like, it's a, it's a true thing. You get this natural high, these endorphins, and when you're, when you're that, you're in that peak state of like, goodness, that's when you should make the choices and the decisions that you wanna make because you have more courage to do things that scare you. And so that's why I work out. We're so excited to hear about you taking on the role of yeah. Shape Magazine co-founder. I mean, mm -hmm. any updates you can share on what that project is gonna be like for you? Uh, what's Yeah, you know, I'm super excited. Again, like I said, I, I really wanna focus again on my acting and I, I, you know, it's a story and a real story, true story um, that I'm really passionate about. I think, you know, everybody knows that I love, you know, healthy living, lifestyle. And so to be able to, um, you know, interpret and play a woman who was such a pioneer mm -hmm. um, in the health and, and, and fitness, um, you know, time where it was so different back then that it was almost looked down upon, almost like it was a freak type thing, um, to actually embracing it and celebrating it and building an entire empire um, that now is so normal to us. DJ, The Rock, like he was in Las Vegas for Mr. Olympia, which was something that they created, uh, Joe and Ben Weider, and he took a picture with Betty and said, you know, and sent it to me, and he was just like, oh, she's amazing, we're talking about you, you're gonna kill this role, and that was when, that day, I had announced that I was doing the movie, wow. so it was kind of cool, I was like, ah. Oh. The rock. Coming full circle, <laughs> I love it. <laughs> yeah, so I hope I get to meet her.